Okay, Stan, I'm going to give you your tour of the Chateau Royale. This is, uh, I'm in the entryway now, going down to the downstairs. And you can see your first preview of um, what's ahead. We have Harrison Ford and Indiana Jones on the wall. Straight ahead is the laundry room. And here we have the Chateau Royale Theater. Beautiful exterior door that I bought because it has better soundproofing and seals. Outside the theater is now playing No Country for Old Men. I'm going to give you a tour of the media closet. This is out here in the hallway. We have all the uh, electronics are in here. We have a laptop. I have a wireless mouse and keyboard so I can fire up the laptop, take the keyboard and mouse, go into the room and see my computer. Instead of being confined to the 12 inch laptop, I can see um, the screen on either the 55 inch TV or the 92 inch um, uh, movie screen. Uh, the controller is uh, here in the dock charging up. You just touch on the icons and I'll switch it to uh, and control everything. TV, uh, cable, Wii, DVD, computer and pretty neat. And behind it is an iPod dock I can dock my iPod and play all my music through the sound system. We have a powered FM, FM antenna. On the wall here is a radio receiver. So when I'm sitting in the room and uh, uh, use the remote, it sends the signals to the antenna here. And uh, this uh, receiver, which is hardwired, uh, from there uh, to all of the equipment. So it relays that radio signal and tells the individual pieces of equipment what to do. There we have a Integra Blu-ray player. Below that is the Integra receiver. Below that is the cable box. We have some Wii stuff in here. And then the bookcase is uh, slowly getting stocked with uh, Blu-rays and Wii stuff. So that's the media closet. Uh, without further ado, let's go into the Chateau Royale. As we enter the room, your first uh, view is of the three-person couch and the back of the room actually beautiful drapery in the corner there is uh, a little niche King Arthur raising his crown we have one of the rare speakers there behind that couch is a um, sit-down granite bar So let's take a walk over there. Let me close this uh, door. The uh, granite sit down bar is uh, Hurricane Gold. Three marshals. Hurricane Gold granite. Beautiful color. The uh, granite is from Brazil. Beautiful Wayne's coating. The um, paint on the wall is full painting and it has a texture to it that uh, is reminiscent of uh, leather. I don't know if you can see that or not but anyway now I'm sitting gonna be sitting down here at the bar which again is behind the, uh, the couch here and we have uh, uh, seats, uh, Judy, Judy seat, and my seat with a table in between for our popcorn and drinks. There's the Sony projector hanging from the ceiling. 
And I'll just scan over here to the door where we just came in from. And uh, I'll scan a little bit more to the bar, Sadie's Saloon. Judy has a stock with top shelf liquor for me. Uh, Sadie, uh, if you uh, don't know, is Judy's middle name. And we just had the uh, tile completed. Let me walk over to the bar. See if you can see that or not. Beautiful glass hand cut tile with metal trim. Came out real nice. And then let's uh, show you the family crest that Judy had uh, commissioned and uh, put in a shadow box. Pretty cool. Below that, thermostat which controls the heating and the uh, in-wall heating uh, rather than baseboards or uh, forced air. And then the middle controller is uh, a Lutron uh, controller which controls all of the lighting scenes. To the right of that is another iPod dock. Beautiful cherry wood wains coating. And uh, just let me, uh, I want to show you here that the couch is on a raised platform, about six inches, it has LED light, uh, rope light goes around the lip of that. And let's uh, show you the front of the room, 55 inch LED flat panel, uh, only one inch thick. On the right and left of it is the uh, cabinetry with the speakers. Um, you can see the speaker cloth there. There's uh, two powered 12-inch uh, Velodyne subwoofers and of course the right and left speaker. Some cabinetry above it. You have uh, sort of a stage uh, below the TV. Uh, center speaker. Uh, below that is a drawer that pulls out with some Wii equipment and some cabinets on the right and left side of that. I love the uh, carpets. Real plush, gives it that real theater uh, feel. Real nice leather uh, seating with ottomans, very comfortable. I love the uh, drapery that Judy did in the room. The sconces are beautiful. Let me dim the light show you the sconces. They are glass hand-blown tulip sconces. Let's turn the lights back on. Take you up to the front of the room. Some uh, electronics in here that control the drop-down projector screen. And up in there is a valance that hides the screen, the screen drops down and clears the TV. And now from the front of the room, or for, yeah, I'm in the front of the room looking towards the back of the room. Here's Judy's chair and mine. And of course the, uh, the couch. And then the uh, the bar. The bar has a uh, refrigerator and um, a drawer microwave. Pretty cool. Let me just zoom in on the bar. And uh, the next video will show you the screen coming down. Uh, that's a short, like, 50 second video. And then the third video will uh, show you the projector fired up and uh, what the uh, screen looks like. Crown molding around the room is dropped uh, about two inches and there's an LED rope light all around it and in the ceiling are three inch recessed lights. Um, can't find those at Lowe's or Home Depot. It had to be custom ordered. We have 17 of them. Halogen recessed lights. Okay so on to part two.